Hello again. I've got another rebind to show you guys. Uh, this is a Reformation Study Bible from Ligonier, and uh, I got this Bible from uh, a brother, a friend of mine, a brother on Facebook, and we hooked up while uh, we were both at T4G, and he let me bring this home with me, and I finally got a chance to work on it and uh, got it finished today. So uh, this is a brown goat skin. Uh, we actually had some issues getting the right leather. Uh, the leather I'd ordered for this rebind uh, had some scuffs and stuff. So I had to actually get another one sent to me. And I really like the one that was sent uh, as a replacement. It just really looks great. has a great soft, soft feel to it. Um, the, um, the spine has like seven ribs. It has the two on top and bottom the one in the center and then these two small ribs uh, offsetting the center rib. Uh, he liked that kind of style and uh, and I think it looks pretty good. Uh, also, uh, there's an extra reinforcement on the spine of the binding, just the binding. So you can kind of see the, as it's pretty thick, it starts here and uh, ends here and it, it just kind of helps keep that spine from wrinkling and it keeps it pretty sturdy i've done that on the last few bibles i've done and uh it really helps uh keep that uh you know looking more uniform and and uh nice so you can see the uh the grain I put this grain pattern, or this grain pattern was already in the leather, of course, but the way I cut it, I had it centered up so that it would be in the center of the spine. I just think it looks really neat having that ridge, uh, that, that heavier grain right in the center. This is a full yap all the way around. Uh, the uh, top and bottom come together and, and they, they meet like that. Uh, the uh, front kind of overlaps just a little bit, just a, I mean, just about an eighth of an inch. They, so they're they're about the same length, yep, yeah, all the way around. And you can see the ribbons. Uh, there's two brown, two navy blue, and I did brown blue, brown, brown blue. So uh, it just has a really cool look to it, and. Uh, the, I left the ribbons really long since it's such a big bobble. And the uh, the yap is so big, it would look kind of silly, uh, almost a little silly if the ribbons are really short. Uh, the ribbons that came in here, there were four ribbons that came in this edition. They were all brown, but they were like that long, about three inches long past the block. And just not as, and they were smaller, so they just weren't as functional and practical as these larger ribbons. So you can see the uh, the yap there, and uh, it'll it'll train down and look really nice over time. But it already has a pretty decent look. So when we open it up, you can see that it's a saddle tan goat skin uh, for the liner as well, and uh, we have these. Uh, navy blue textured cardstock end sheets and it kind of ties together the blue and brown uh, ribbons with the the brown cover so it, it, it's a pretty good color palette there I really like how it looks together so uh, we open it up uh, it has a really nice footprint if I can get above it a little bit it just lays out really nicely it uh since this leather's pretty soft it doesn't want to slide around real easily uh so it's uh it's meant to be pretty stationary also let me go about to the middle and i'll do the hand test and uh he he wanted a really floppy really floppy bible so you can see as i pick it up my hand is only on the spine i'm not even grabbing the sides it's only sitting on the spine and you can see how floppy this cover is. This thing is floppy. And with the extra spine reinforcement, do you see how the spine's not folding in half? It just has a nice gentle arc. And that's with my, my hand just on the spine. So if I, if I spread my hand out just a little bit, 
to hold it, it, it sits pretty nicely due to the tabs being so long. Uh, so it actually has a decent readability with it being so floppy. So it's a very, very floppy uh, cover. And uh, while also being re the spine being reinforced and, and it being pretty strong. So uh, the back, let me go to the back, sorry. Go to the back, you can see the same uh, texture cardstock end sheets and the, uh, the back liner with uh, the corner work on the back there. And then the back of the cover looks really nice. This is actually a, uh, it's called a chocolate brown uh, goat skin from the the vendor I get I use on uh, on eBay Really like this goat skin. I'll have to make sure I get another one uh, for uh, More rebinds. So anyway, uh, that's basically it. It's a it's just a really big Bible with a full yap. It's just uh, You don't see them very often Bibles this big with that full yap and I know it's a it's gonna be a really unique uh, Bible for him Hopefully it serves him for a long time to come. And uh, anyway, glad to uh, glad to be able to show you guys this Bible. So uh, thankful for everyone that uh, subscribes and watches these videos uh, because that's really uh, a means of of advertisement. And uh, you know, the, kind of the a lot of my customers have come from YouTube subscribers. Uh, so thank you guys, and remember to. Uh, to uh, subscribe if you're not a subscriber and be eligible for uh, giveaways that I have every month and you'll get notifications for new videos and reviews and uh, all kind of cool stuff. So anyway, thank you guys for watching. God bless.